FinTRV, the Financial Innovation uh, Technology Association, is a part of the organization of this uh, award ceremony. An advisory company and the first fintech association joined forces to organize this award ceremony. Banks with new regulations coming along every day are highly uh, competing among each other, and Turkish fintech companies are opening up uh, their businesses abroad, and this is also a source of pride for us. And the award ceremony that's about to come out will uh, complement uh, the people that have been contributed, contributing to this area. We have two very valuable female managers that are behind this. Please welcome Demet Zubeydoğlu, FinTech Association Turkey leader, and Sinan Can Türk, representing KPMG, digital finance leader of KPMG, Sinan Can Türk. A strong applause for Sinem Dantuk as well. Welcome. Please come along towards the middle of this stage. So in order for the industry to become internationally competitive, uh, we believe that the contribution of this event is very important, thanks to your leadership. Uh, I'd like to hand over to Demet. First of all, Thank you so very much for coming here again. Without you, there would be no reason for us to be here, actually. So in digital finance, in Pioneers of Digital Finance Awards, when we started discussing this whole concept with uh, Isina about, I think, four years ago, four or five years ago, yes. And as we tried to position ourselves in this area was that our purpose was the following. We wanted to promote the internationalization of certain solutions that we have. And also, our banks create all of these uh, innovative solutions and we wanted to award them. So I guess in the second year, uh, along with other advancements, we have come a long way, uh, I believe. Here in the jury, we have uh, we've had uh, Jayla from Brighton University. We have very valuable people and then we have Balma, Professor Balma from Kudahas University. So the awards uh, have turned into an academic work as well. I think that's something that we need to underscore. And it's also hopefully going to turn into um, an annual report. So I believe that these awards are very important. Along with uh, Sinam, we have uh, been working a lot on this. And we would like to congratulate everyone who applied for these awards and everyone who have won. Actually, I'd like to make efficient use of time, so without uh, going into repeats, I'd like to say hello, everyone. So this is the second uh, Pioneers of Digital Finance Awards, and welcome to our award ceremony. Just like Demet said, we started about four or five years ago. We've been discussing fervently, and we wanted to kickstart it. But at the same time, we always wanted to do the best. And in order to uh, start in the best way possible, we said, OK, let's just begin from some place, and maybe we can improve ourselves along the way. And I'm very happy we did so, because last year, we had um, a lot of participation. We had three banks and four fintech companies uh, that were awarded as pioneers of digital finance. But because we want to take things a step further, uh, both in the applications and the evaluation process and also in the jury process, we wanted to take things to the next level. Just like Demet said, which I think is very important, the jury evaluation process uh, involved the help of uh, Jalan and Balma professors, and so we now have a, an academic foundation. It's not just distribution awards to people. We now have a point-based system. Uh, we justify every point that we give to people, so it, uh, the efforts turn into an academic work. And we also wanted to turn this into an annual report. 
um, hopefully we'll have an academic annual report, that the first of which we will share with you hopefully in September or October. And we wanted to also increase the categories in the awards. Uh, that's all obviously helped by uh, the maturity of the industry, and there has been increasing demand as well. So this year we're going to uh, award four uh, banks as opposed to three last year, and this year we're going to have an increasing number of fintech companies that will be rewarded. So. I guess we have fulfilled our duties of taking things to the next level. And I'd like to express thank yous. Uh, we would like to thank you, the participants who joined the surveys. We would like to thank you infinitely because uh, we've attracted a lot of interest and a lot of detailed questions also uh, were sent to us. Thank you for the attention because we are seeing how you are paying attention to Pioneers of Digital Finance turning into a brand of its own. And I would like to also thank jury members. Some of them are with us, but some of them are not with us uh, due to certain reasons. But we would like to thank them all because we might have tired them out during this academic evaluation process. But hopefully it was fun for them. And uh, let's hope that they'll be with us next year as well. And we would like to thank in advance uh, everyone who has won uh, the awards. Thank you for joining, applying, and thank you for being with us. Let's keep you a little bit on the stage because we are going to carry on with giving out the awards. The special jury award will be given out by Sinam Janturk. The special jury prize is won by Garanti BBVA Crypto. A strong round of applause. Please welcome Korjan Abale to receive the award. Congratulations. Let's take a photo first. Thank you. Maybe a few words from you. Congratulations. I would like to thank my team, the visionary managers of our investors from Guarantee BBVA, our domestic and international stakeholders, and esteemed customers. They have not let us alone on this journey. And with this experience, this product and service, uh, we have been able to reach out the entire country. Thank you. Now the second day, Financial Inclusion Award. We'd like to have Demet to give it out. The winner of the Financial Inclusion Award is for Petra Lab. Fatura Lab. Please welcome Emre Aydın. The Financial Inclusion Award goes to Emre Aydın from Fatura Lab. A few words from Emre Aydın. I would like to thank the entire jury. Four years ago, we started our journey, and we wanted to start operational uh, capital solutions. We wanted to also build our work on transparency and trust. And one reason why we applied for this award was that trust and uh, transparency we thought were going to be taken into consideration by the jury. Thank you very much. We'd like to have Mustafa Baltaji. Mustafa Baltaji is about to join us right now. to give out the next award. The Innovative Fintech 
is the next award that we'll give out. Mustafa Bal Tadjil will hand it over to Team Sek. A strong round of applause. It's the Tarikan Kurolo will be representing Team Sek. few words from you, maybe. Thank you so much to the jury. When we applied for this award, our purpose was to make sure that uh, we offered alternatives to the investment industry. We uh, offer cash to new banks and other companies as well, and we are very honored by this award. Thank you very much. Thank you so much. Esteemed guests, we have another award in this category, the Emerging Fintech. Please welcome Murat Asa from KPMG. The project owner will receive their award from Murat, chairman of KPMG. The Emerging Fintech winner is Tarfin. Shemsa Basolo, representing Tarfin, will be receiving the award. Congratulations. Congratulations to all of you. A few words from you. We would like to thank you, Demet and Sinem, as well. We're not only in fintech, but uh, we're also in the e-agri business. So thank you for in involving agriculture in this award, in these awards as well. Thank you. It's made us really happy to see someone from agriculture as well. Now please welcome Demet to give out the award here. The Global Fintech Award will be handed out. The winner is United Payment. Adem Aykan, the general manager of United Payment, will be here representing their team. Congratulations. Congratulations to United Payment for the Global Fintech Award. We'd like to thank the jury. We're carrying on our growth globally. Hopefully, we will also achieve our unicorn goal as well very soon. Thank you again. Thank you for all your efforts. Now, the Pioneer Fintech. Winner will be announced by John Turk. Sinam John Turk. The winner is Kolendi. Bilan Tekman from Kolendi will be receiving the award here. Bilan Tekman will be receiving the award on behalf of Kolendi. <laughs> I'll be very fast because I'm busy as well. Thank you so very much. It's been a very good work. We're actually quite like dinosaurs in the in the fintech area. We have been able to do different kinds of work in Kolanda and other places. Thank you so much for your efforts. And now it is the category for banking. The first award is the Special Jury Award. And CCW Technology Investments um, founder, 
and financial institutions uh, union uh, member Adam Duman will come to the stage to present this award. We have been unable to find Mr. Adam. I'm going to ask Demet to present the award instead for Jury Special Award. QNB Finansman will deserve a round of applause. Burcu Yilmaz will receive the award on behalf of QNB Finansman. Congratulations. She will receive the award on behalf of her team and on behalf of her bank. Congratulations, and I'm giving you the mic. Thank you very much. I would like to thank the jury for their evaluation and for this organization as well. QNB Finance Bank has innovation in its DNA, and keep watching us. Thank you. And another award for the banking category is the collaborative bank, I mean, who will be presenting the award. And Mustafa Baltaje will come to the stage to present the award. And the winner is Kuwait Turk and Selim Tashtan to the stage, please, to receive the award. Selim will receive the award from Mustafa. Congratulations. Congratulations, collaborative bank. This category, the award of this category is presented to Kuwait Turk. Selim Tashtan is receiving the award on behalf of Kuwait Turk from Mustafa Baltaja. Congratulations. And I'd like to congratulate your team as well. A few words. I'd like to thank everyone for organizing this event. I'd like to thank the jury for selecting us. Kuwait Turk has been working on next-gen banking and the banking of the future. We have strategic efforts towards that, and we have been undertaking these efforts. And this has been basically the fruit of all these efforts. I'd like to thank everyone again. Thank you very much, Mustafa. And Sinam will again come to the center point of the stage because she will present the Visionary Bank Award. And the winner is Akbank. Congratulations, Akbank. Burju Kuchikinal will come to the stage to receive the award on behalf of Akbank. A stronger round of applause is something that she deserves. That's it. Thank you. Congratulations. Thank you, everyone. Thank you for this organization. And thank you for the opportunity to be with you in this FinTech ecosystem. It's quite a precious opportunity for us. Thank you very much for bringing us together. So being a visionary bank, being a visionary bank and an institution is also related with our capability to implement it. And it was possible for us to do that. It was because of our young and dynamic team. Akbank is our innovation center, but at the same time, since 2016 blockchain, AI, and new technologies have been the areas where we conducted efforts, and probably I had the chance to work with many people in this room, and we will always maintain this vision. Thank you very much again. Thank you. And the last category is the Pioneer Bank, the last winner, will be announced by Demet again. So the bank which is most open to innovation, the Pioneer Bank uh, Award, is going to Ishbank. And Emre Ölçer is going to come to the stage to receive this award. The Pioneer Bank most open to innovation has been named Ishbank, and I'd like to congratulate you all. So, 
Well, the award ceremony has its second edition right now, and it's receiving a lot of attention, and it's really great development. I also give the microphone to Emre for a few uh, words. I'd like to thank everyone for organizing this event and being chosen for this award for two consecutive years has been a great opportunity for us as well because we always contribute to the development of this area and all the banks and all fintechs and all stakeholders who have been deemed worthy of awards. I'd like to congratulate them as well. Turkey is taking leaps this year and I believe that um, it will be quite successful this year as well. So we're not going to let you go now. And now that we're at the end of our award ceremony, I. I'm going to invite all the valuable people who have been presented awards, and it would be a great opportunity for us to take a photograph with you if you carried your awards with you as well. Nigel Kaimak, you're more than welcome, cordially welcome. All the executives who received awards, we'd like to see all of you on the stage. And I would like to thank the participation and attention of all the participants here. And a big round of applause to the award winners. Now we're going to conclude that important moment with this um, nice photo shooting session. And it's not going to end here. We will continue with Ilber Ortayla, Mr. Professor. And he is going to have a pleasurable con conversation um, with our colleagues. A big round of applause to all award winners, esteemed executives who have received these awards. And this is basically an amazing scene. And we're concluding the award ceremony. We would like to thank everyone for their efforts. And we'd like to thank you for your valuable contributions to the industry. And we are concluding the award ceremony with this.